This afternoon, a family has a roof over their heads after getting help they did not expect. The mom and her kids were living in their car. As Channel 2's Linda Stouffer found out, new at 4 o'clock, Atlanta police officers saw a way to turn a ticket into a brighter future. Ebony Rhodes has three sons and a daughter, and many reasons to be thankful this Christmas. I tell them all the time, pray, pray, pray. Last December, her family was living out of her car, and she hit rock bottom in a traffic stop. There were problems with her driver's license. There was no registration for this car, so an Atlanta police officer impounded the vehicle. But there was just one problem. For a mother and her four children, this car meant everything. When I got off work, we just sleep right there in the parking lot in the car. A lot of people didn't know that, you know, because I was still going to work. Several Atlanta officers found out about the family situation and stepped up with heart. And some great ideas. Deputy Chief Jeff Glazier helped get the car back, find a shelter, and then an affordable apartment. If we were to let, you know, Ebony's family fail, I think that would be a failure on us. And so I think we have to all come together and help each other out. Rhodes also has serious health problems. And to make ends meet, 17 year old Calvin goes from his high school straight to work. I'm to work till like 10 or 11. You wouldn't expect an average 17 year old to do things that he does. And it brings a lot of joy to me. It really does. Now APD officers are launching a GoFundMe to cover bills for a year so the family can catch up. We are more alike than unalike. And, uh, you know, we're all in this together. Atlanta Police Department is like my backbone. They, they've helped me come a long, long way. And sometimes that assist is even a police escort to school. To look at how you impact people every day and the good that can come out of it if you really listen to somebody else's story. In Southwest Atlanta, Linda Stover, Channel 2 Action News.